Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Virgos. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Virgos. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy temple of yours, Virgos, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages Source, your guardian angels, and your ancestors have here for you today. Shout out to the Evolving Spirit. Shout out to the Patreon Soul family as well. I appreciate each and every one of you all for being here and your continuous love and support. Thank you so much, beautiful souls. Your love is never unnoticed on this platform. And welcome to the ones that are new here, Virgos. It is also a pleasure to have each and every one of you all here. Thank you for your comments and your feedback down below. I see you, I hear you, and most of all, I appreciate you. All right. This week, color we are focusing in on this week is purple. Yes, we're focusing in this week on our crown chakra and evolving spiritually, mentally, and emotionally here at Virgos. All right. So definitely, if you're new here, keep up with the community board. That is where I do post the new colors that we transition to each week. We do understand here that colors have their own frequency and vibration and is a great way to help us evolve spiritually, mentally, and emotionally. All right. So no further ado here, Virgos. Let's dive into your reading here today. We're first going to start with an oracle message here from your guardian angels and your ancestors to see what messages they have for you today and for out this week. And then we're going to dive deeper into your love reading with the traditional tarot deck. And then definitely stick around. I'm going to utilize my raw tarot deck that I created to provide you more insight and details on your love life, all right? To see how this person feels about you, what they want to say to you, and what is going on in your surrounding energies, all right? So no further ado, let's dive in, Virgos. Wow, we have honesty here, all right? And look at all the purple here. Yes, I love it, Virgos. We have, I can't always expect the truth, Virgos, from others, but I can't accept it from myself, all right? Yes, all right? So this is indicating a situation here that some of you all may feel like someone in your space or your energy here was not being honest about a situation or a circumstance here, all right? And you know deep down in your heart or in your soul that whatever you request of yourself, you're going to be honest with yourself, right? You're going to be up for with how you feel. But I feel like when it comes to you, your partner, or whomever this particular person or situation here is dealing with here, this is someone that you feel like that should feel the same way or that they should be honest with you just is as they're honest to themselves. But unfortunately, someone here was not being honest to you or this person may feel like you, Virgo, was not being honest with this particular person here, okay? Again, take it how it resonates for you, but we know that honesty here seems to be the meat and potatoes here are very important regarding this situation or circumstance here. So, wow, very interesting here. All right, this is what your guardian angels here want you to know as far as honesty is very important when it comes to this connection, especially when it comes to communicating with your significant other or your partner at this time. All right, so wow, let's see how this all plays out here with the word or the oracle message here of honesty today here. All right, but knowing that you can expect the honesty truth from yourself. So we just have to go with what we feel intuitively and what's going to be the best outcome for us, right? So let's now dive into your love life here and let's see how this all ties in together, all right? Wow, yeah. We have the two of swords here. Now, this is air elements here, Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra energy here. Some of y'all, this person here may be an air sign here, all right? But this card indicates making a decision and at the same time being cautious, okay, 
you can notice how she has her hands over her chest. She's guarding her heart, her feelings, and her emotions here with the water in the background because she don't know everything here. So she is definitely in the energy of making sure to guard her feelings and her emotions towards this situation here because someone here again may was not being honest in this situation or not speaking up in regarding what may have happened or transpired when it came to this relationship or situation here, Virgo. So let's get more insight here. Yes, look at you showing up in your reading today. We have the Hermit card here, all right? This is energy that indicates that you are now deciding to isolate yourself or this person here is deciding to isolate themselves from people, from situations and circumstances that you now feel like no longer resonates with you or for you, all right? You may feel like the people that you have involved in or been around here may have delayed your growth or just you evolving as a spiritual being here and trying to get your ducks in a row here and detach your energies from people that you feel like are no longer your highest good. And you're searching for things that you feel like is going to make Virgo happy here and people that you feel like that will be honest with you. All right, is why the hermit card normally shows up in a reading because of the hermit energy or you wanting to isolate yourself from people, places, or situations that you no longer feel like is going to be great for your highest good, okay? So you could be, you know, crossing out things that you feel like or editing out people that you feel like are no longer meeting your needs of growth and expansion here because, again, with this situation or this person you may feel like is not being and honest with you you may feel uncomfortable in your intuition because this person may have done things in the past here or just their behavior patterns have made you feel some type of way about them or this situation here right so let's see what else here yeah the king of swords so you're making sure to set some boundaries here for individuals or people here that you may feel like have intervened in your space or have you know stepped over any type of boundaries when it comes towards you because you feel like if i'm able to be honest with you my apologies there if i'm able to be honest with you if i'm able to move forward in this relationship in this connection i feel like the same should be done on this person's end or whoever that you have had this connection here with okay which definitely makes sense, all right? So I feel like until you're able to get reciprocated energy or given even exchange energy, you are deciding to, you know, separate yourself from others or, again, ghost individuals that are not on the same frequency or vibration as you. And others of you all, this could how your person here could feel as well towards you or this connection when it comes to others that they have been with for quite some time that haven't been giving them the same given even exchange energies here wow very significant reading here today virgos definitely if so so far this is resonating for you giving you insight and details on what you maybe was already intuitively picking up about yourselves and about this situation here again don't forget to like like subscribe virgos we would love to have you here part of our soul family be sure to again adjust your notification bell so when i go live on this platform i do go live for all zodiac sign readings if you would love to stop by and get a check-in before you get your day there started and again i am back now available for personal readings if you would love to book a personal reading all my details and email information it was down below in the description box all right so as we close out as i mentioned i'm going to use my raw tarot deck here to get more insight and details regarding this person or this situation here and again if you enjoy the raw tarot deck readings that i do here on this platform i now have established a only fans page for my raw tarot deck readings if you would love to subscribe to the platform there and receive daily content from my raw tarot deck readings that i created you are more than welcome to subscribe there we would love to have you there and i do also plan on going live there as well if that is something that you're interested in all right so let's see what we have here for you today wow i will fight for you virgos very interesting here so this person here is willingly to fight for you they're willingly to fight for this situation so i feel like because you decided to step away step down Pull your energy back. Now someone is wanting to pull towards you. Isn't it funny how the shoes 
or the situation changes because you pull back, right? It's like, where was that energy when I was informing you of this and being honest with you and telling you how I felt about the situation, right? Now they're wanting to come in and fight and make things right here for you. Yeah, we got you make me happy. So it's like now this person is telling you what you want to hear. So this person may could have, you know, kept themselves guarded from their feelings, not expressing themselves, not telling you how they feel about a situation here. Yeah, look at that. No more sneaking around. It's you. It's like everything now is coming out about this person and how they feel because you decided to remove yourself from this situation here. Yeah, look at that. This is not fair. I want you. So now this person feels like it's not fair now this person wants you or now this person wants to put in the effort when i feel like you were trying to inform this person of this quite some time now right yeah look at that i want some more of you okay it's like now this person is missing you when at the beginning you were wanting this type of love generosity and support from this person when you felt like that you wasn't getting this here yeah look at that i can't control myself around you so now this person is like look i can't control myself without virgos i don't know what's going on here okay yeah i am keeping you to myself all right and some of y'all have someone new here that you are exchanging energies here with as well here that is wanting to keep you here to themselves okay wow last card here we have is i want do this again virgos wow interesting here so again look like someone here as well has definitely learned their lesson or now has understood that you're not playing any games here you want what you want you know what you're deserving of you've been honest with this particular person and all you have been simply asking for is for this person to be honest with you so now this person feels like okay i can't do this to virgos i can't keep doing this i can't be sneaking around i can't just be disrespecting virgos and Virgo is giving me the same respect in return. So, wow, Virgos, I don't want to stretch it out too far. But, however, if you would love to book a person reading, my email details is down below. Again, definitely subscribe to our fans only page for more uploads of daily content of raw tarot deck readings if that's something that you're interested in. Again, thank you so much, Soul Tribe and Soul Family. I definitely appreciate each and every one of you all. And we definitely shall chit chat soon, Virgos. You all take care. Bye-bye.